For a young Anna Callias, life in Estonia in the 1930s was good. Ahead of her time, Anna founded a business tutoring children with learning disabilities in her hometown of Parnu, a resort city on the Gulf of Riga, where she lived with her parents, her sister Ilsa and her brother Jan. Her father ran a hotel and her mother managed the family home. She's pictured here on a hunting trip. Rifle slung over her shoulder, Anna embodies all the swagger and confidence of youth. But her happy life began to crumble in 1939 when Nazi Germany and the Soviet Union signed a secret agreement to divide Europe between the two nations. The West for Germany, the East for the Soviets. Estonia fell into the Soviet zone. So when Germany invaded Western Poland in September 1939, the Soviets moved troops into Estonia under the guise of protecting the small state from Nazi aggression. But it led to a Soviet occupation and eventual annexation. For two years, Estonians were terrorized by the Soviets. Thousands, including Anna, suffered under blacklists, detentions, mass deportations, and even killings. Okay. Uh, more and more people were taken, and uh, 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 even my girlfriend were, were stuck. Uh, 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 and uh, for no reason whatsoever, because the mother had uh, missing business, and the daughter was shot, and the mother and father were put in jail, and then they sent to Siberia. They want to destroy the intelligence of the whole country.